and Mauro Cicero has the Mustangs' first goal of the season. If the name Mauro Cicero sounds familiar, well, that's no coincidence. Cicero was named the American Athletic Conference Offensive Player of the Year in 2015, and this year, he's back. He's grown up a lot over the last three years. Um, you know, he, he leads more by example than he does by, um, by vocal yelling and, and, you know, those sorts of things. His most notable performance so far? His hat trick in a season opener against UC Davis that led SMU to a 3-2 victory. He got the PK, so it's tied 2-2, and then, you know, just you just got to create one chance in the last five minutes, and then it just went in. So it was really good, you know, for, for me and the whole team, you know, experience on your first game and start the season well. He knows the performances he lays down will uh, have a direct impact on where he ends up next year. So uh, he came in very focused and prepared for the season, and, um, you know, it's showing off in the first seven games. So where did these skills come from? Well, soccer success is no secret to the Citro family. Imagine having two older brothers that have played professionally and a father that played professional soccer. So you could say that Mauro received a soccer ball around the same time that he got his pacifier. Every week and just spending on the couch with him and just watching soccer games, you know, kind of growing up like that and having him as an example of, you know, what he did in his life and, and having my brothers as well, just kind of setting the bar. You know, it's awesome having him, you know, come down every game. You know, he drives, you know, three hours down, three hours back from Oklahoma to come just, you know, come watch me. And, you know, it kind of motivates me, you know, that someone so, like cares so much about me. And, you know, sometimes I'll be playing bad and I can hear him, you know, say some bad words in Spanish and I kind of shake my head sometimes he's a little loud, but that's good. Last year as a junior, Mario struggled to see that same kind of success, scoring only three goals and one assist. But his senior season so far is showing that the off season strengthened more than just his soccer skills. Not just me being the leader, we have eight other seniors that you know are playing a lot and that helps, you know, and we just we don't have to just rely on one player to be the leader. He's a guy that would rather show you what to do than have uh, have to yell at you. With already five goals and four assists and we're not even halfway through the season, you could say we have a lot to look forward to from Mara. We always look forward to playing Tulsa and you know, like we always just wanna especially knock them off, uh, with them being our closest rivals. For Campus Connect, this is SMU's Emma Kate View.